couldn't be Eden who's trying to drive me crazy. I know that now. It's got to be that English woman and her husband. But why? Why? Are you talking to me, Dad? No, 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 Warren, I wasn't. I was, uh, I was just talking to myself. Okay, surely that is okay in the Lockridge Asylum? Uh, sure, Dad, no problem. Uh, just take it easy, okay? Yeah, yeah, sure, Warren. I, uh, I just don't like being caught acting crazy, even though I'm feeling that way myself these days. Yeah, well, I'm sure I haven't been much help to you. But you gotta be feeling pretty good about the Amanda Lockridge. Then why? Well, all you people seem to be saying it's it's shifted again. It looks like we'll be able to dive back down to it. What do you mean, we? We? As in us? You know, I've been getting pretty psyched about the whole thing. Mm. You know, I'm looking forward to uh, being a part of the of the whole search and discovery mission. And I really like the idea of being able to pin the fact on the Capwells that they were responsible for sinking our ship. Warren, why don't you just forget about the Amanda Lockridge for a while? Yeah, but, Dad, I thought that was a... The... Warren, I want you to tell me something right now, okay? I want you to explain to me why you stole from the Capwells. And specifically, why you took only Sophia's stuff, only the coin. I don't want to talk about it, Dad. I well, we're going to talk about it, Warren. Can we just drop it? No. I thought when I got those coins back to you, that'd be the end of it. Well, it wasn't. Now, I want the answer, Warren. Now. Tell me now. Okay, look, I knew you'd been seeing Sophia. Would you explain that exactly? Look, I found out that you and Sophia were seeing each other back then. Oh, so you heard some rumors, so you believe that they were true? Huh? Dad, I'm not the only one who knew. Channing Jr. knew about it way before I did. Matter of fact, he said he was going to expose the whole thing. Well, go on. Look, I was a lot younger then. It just really upset me that, that you were cheating on Mom, giving gifts to Sophia. All right, so she's dead, and the, the whole thing's over. I still couldn't stand it. Channing wasn't about to let it die, either. Dad, I just figured I, the only thing I could do was get those coins out of the Capwell house. At least that way they wouldn't be able to pin you, connect the two of you together. Warren, wh why didn't you tell me that this bothers you that way? Oh, why didn't I tell you? Dad, I was maybe 19 years old. Come on. I didn't realize it was a mandatory age at, at which it's okay to tell your father that something has upset you. That's not the point. Just suppose I'd come to you. Say, hey, Dad, I understand you're getting it on with Sophia Capwell and people are beginning to find out. What do you think that would have gotten me, huh? I don't know. Look, the result would have been the same. Dad, you've never discussed your private life with me, and I sure didn't want anybody else to find out about it. So I took the coins. That was the only reason? Hell yeah, that was the only reason. Uh, I'm very sorry that I yelled at you. Yeah. Yeah, okay. Listen, when you talked about this whole thing with Channing, did you discuss anything about Sophia? Anything more about her? There was no point, Dad. That was more than enough. All right. Obviously, I cared more about your marriage than you did. Warren, you don't understand all the circumstances. You're still not going to talk to me about it, are you? I guess maybe there is a mandatory age. But I'm too old to care about it, huh? Right, it's true. I did see Sophia. It was a long time ago. I did give her the coins. I gave them to her then. And I'm going to take them back to her today. Dad, what are you talking about? Sophia Capwell is dead. I know. Back. I always have to come back. Look at me. I have got to be gone. 